IELTS Speaking Part 1. Topic 41, Patience. Were you patient when you were younger? I think I was quite patient. I don't remember throwing a tantrum or getting upset when I didn't get what I wanted straight away, so I think I was quite calm and understanding as a child. How do you feel when other people are not patient? I think it's often quite rude and unnecessary to become impatient because it rarely helps. It doesn't make the bus come faster and it doesn't make other people work harder either. So I think people should try to stay calm and not let their emotions get to them. Are you less or more patient when you're angry? If I'm annoyed or upset, then my patience definitely wears thin. It's always difficult to control your emotions in stressful situations and I'm no different. Topic 42, Voice Has your voice ever changed? Of course, there's a phase in human life when our voice tends to change during adolescence, especially in boys. Also, there are instances when we have abused and overused our voices so that we can have a sore throat that leads to a harsh or even hoarse voice. Do you like your own voice? Honestly, I don't. I always wanted an angelic voice, but unfortunately, I wasn't gifted. I also love singing, but singing doesn't love me. So I've just settled on singing in the bathroom, where I can imagine my voice rocks the house. Do you enjoy recording your voice and listening to it? No way. My voice is so horrible that I, myself, am terrified of it. I can't stand listening to it, but I have no choice. I must admit, I recorded it once and listened to it. That's the time I realized, never again. Does your voice sound similar to your parents? Unfortunately not. My dad is an excellent singer, and my grandmother used to tell me stories about my father's childhood. They would go to a radio station and he would sing live and on air, but I guess I wasn't able to inherit his genes. Topic 43, Public Holiday. How many public holidays do you have in Vietnam? Officially, seven public holidays spread across the year and they're to help people relax and enjoy themselves and commemorate and celebrate special events. Do you think people need more public holidays? I think if we had more public holidays, then people wouldn't complain. People always want chances to relax and see their friends and loved ones. So, as long as the holiday is culturally important and not too commercial, I think people would love it. How do you usually spend your holidays? When I was growing up, my family and I would always go to see my grandparents or my relatives on public holidays, and that's something I still do now. I think it's important to keep the tradition going and it's a good opportunity to see my parents and relatives too. Which holiday is your favourite? Personally, I've always loved Lunar New Year, probably because it's the longest holiday we have, but it's a great opportunity to see my friends, my relatives and loved ones, and a chance to relax and unwind as well. Topic 44, Tea and Coffee.
Do Vietnamese people like to drink tea or coffee? I think Vietnamese people are big fans of both. Tea is usually more traditional, but coffee has become more and more popular, so you can see people enjoying both drinks throughout the day. Do you prepare tea or coffee for guests in your home? Absolutely. I'm a big coffee drinker and so are my friends, so any time they come over, I brew a pot of coffee and share it with them. When was the last time you drank tea or coffee? I actually drank some coffee this morning. I drink coffee every morning because it gives me energy and it helps me wake up too. Topic 45, the area you live in. Do you like the area that you live in? Yes, I do. Everything I need is within walking distance, like the supermarket, restaurants and cinemas too. So I enjoy living here. What are some changes in the area recently? I've seen a lot of new apartments being built and also some new shopping malls too. I also see a lot of new families arrive into the area because my neighborhood is growing quite quickly. Do you know any famous people in your area? I don't think so, usually because most people move to the center of Beijing before they become famous. So, because my village is on the outskirts, we don't have any claims to fame or local celebrities. Where do you like to go in your area? I like going to the street market areas in my neighborhood because I'm really into cooking, so I like finding and buying local ingredients and taking them home and eating them.